Welcome once again to Kirby's Epic Yarn Let's Play, WDPA style. Where I try to harm as few wildies as possible. Last time, the last place we went to was Rainbow Falls, and now we're going to try out Big Bean Vine. Right when we start off, we have our bow and arrow waddledies, or archer waddledies. The bottom one's actually shielding a friend who's sadly scared of Kirby. I wish they wouldn't be afraid of him. These guys are a bit more trickier to avoid, but it is possible. And now, this little parasol waddle here is a big help. I wish they had more roles like this in the game. Instead of attacking Kirby, then lend a helping hand. Yep. That was my fault for being in the way. I'm not gonna harm him still. Get my beads back. Yeah, I can bump him, but... I don't want to bump them all the way off the leaf. You gotta keep them from harming them. Now these are my personal favorite waddledies. The balloon waddledies. They get little balloons. You can stand on their heads, you can stand on the balloons. However, if you stand on the balloons, well, you'll find out. Kirby's heavy enough to make them deflate faster, and they slowly fall away to nothing. And they eventually pop. And the wildy just well, falls back down in the cloud. I wish the balloons were more permanent. Didn't deflate so fast. It would make it the level easier and it would be a lot nicer for the wildies. How do you that guy? This level in itself is a bit challenging if because you I had trouble, I kept falling down over and over and over again. Keep pushing me. More balloon waddlies. I think this is actually the only level you see these type of waddlies in. Which is a shame. I'd love to see them more.
keep on climbing. Oh, shoot. I never threw that bug before. I wanted to get him out of the way. I threw the bug and I didn't know it was a homing bug. I'm sorry, little wallabies. They really should make it so that they can't be harmed with something like that, but then, you know, they wouldn't be enemies. And, well, we don't want them to be enemies. We want them to be friends. Allies. Helpers. That's what the WDPA stands for. The Wildie Protection Act. Making a safer place for Wildies to live and making it so they're no longer enemies in Kirby games. Yay, gold. Alright, well, Fangoron doesn't have any wildies, it's the boss fight. It's weird woods. Molehole doesn't have any wildies either. Weird Woods does, I think. Ah, oh, yes, the UFO level. Very, very hard. You can see even I have trouble with it. Especially not hurting the waddle these. Oh, that was close. You can only suck up the, uh, the birds and the gems, so you're really limited on the amount of, um, amount of electricity you can shoot. What I have the most trouble with is how I keep on, um, hitting the, the, the top of the forest and bouncing back, bouncing back down. Like hitting all these uh, obstacles and be being tossed around the forest like a like a uh, pinball is not the easiest thing in the world. I'm proud to say though I did get through this level without harming any wildies, but I did miss out on that treasure. Well, you can see me miss it again. Yes, it's right there. Keep on hitting the walls and the sides and... Yep, there it goes. And possibly one of the very few boss fights you've ever seen me do a let's play of because it's still in the middle of a Waldy level. Take that, you tree. You're nothing like Wispy. The red eye. That's why I think I have I think I have a few of those puff things in my bedroom. No no not a mumby. You cannot suck up mummies. I don't know about the UFO, but I'm not gonna try it. 